In this video, I'm going to show you scanned pages of a 1997 unproduced Star Wars toy booklet that came with this Tom Art Star Wars Collectibles price guide. So now we'll look at some vehicle prototypes. We have a pretty nice drawing and a prototype of the Rebel Blockade Runner. It was unproduced, but they would have sold it in the Return of the Jedi line. And on the right are mini rig concepts, which I don't care for. At the bottom are concept package artwork and packaging design concepts. For the X-Wing prototypes on the right hand page, I'm just going to read the text. So it says three X-Wing fighters in various stages of pre-production at the top. These samples allow designers to confirm the fit of all parts, check the operation of the wing mechanism, and perform safety tests. The black version with multicolored parts was probably the initial production test of the mold. The near finished version became the final engineering pilot when Kenner and Lucasfilm approved the product for manufacturing. Below that has photos of a two-figure X-Wing trainer found in the Kenner archives. This was proposed as a possible 1986 line extension, and it's interesting to note that the figure in the forward cockpit with goggles in position. This may have been intended as a new figure had this product actually been produced. On this page it says work on the White Witch vehicle ended with the cancellation of the droids and Ewoks lines. But oh, what's interesting is it shows the concept drawing, early mock-ups for the vehicle and packaging, plus two views of the final painted prototype. So at the top of this page, it's vehicle packaging mock-ups featuring the Revenge of the Jedi logo. At the bottom, the A-Wing fighter was originally the power of the Force, but it was discarded when it was selected for the droids line. Other unproduced toys videos will be added to the playlist. You can also check out other popular videos on my channel. May the force be with you and please subscribe for more.